Well, hey friends, it's Mandy with Sweetly Home, and today I have a consignment sale haul for you of some things that I picked up for my kiddos for the fall, fall winter season. <laughs> when I shop for the new seasons, I always hit the consignment store first. I save so much money by shopping at the consignment stores. I get name brand quality items for such a discount. Our thrift store is not very thrifty um, and I don't know, every season I have to buy new clothes for my kids because I don't have anybody in our world that really passes down clothes to us. So every season I'm outfitting a whole new wardrobe. So for me, I always go to the consignment store first. So let me share with you what I got my kiddos. Okay, so let's start with Colt. Colt is four years old, um, and I found him this really cute um, fleece pullover from Old Navy. I don't have the prices for these items because I went shopping and we immediately, I came home, I went to my, I was at my mother-in-law's, tried everything on him, we took the tags off and she washed them, so everything was like ready to go by the time I got home. When I'm looking for fleece items, I always, always, always make sure that things are not pilled. If you can sign clothes or even if you just wear fleece yourself or your children do, the way to wash fleece is you fold it inside out and then all of the fibers will brush on the inside of the garment and then that's where the pilling will occur. Apparently this mama knew that trick because this has been worn and washed, but the fleece is wonderful. So this is totally him. So then I found this little sweatshirt and this is from the children's place. And then I found this little shirt. This is from Carter's. And it's just a really nice um, kind of waffle knit sort of long sleeved shirt. And I got him a pair of jeans. Now these jeans just fit him now. Um, they're size four. They're from Joe Fresh brand. They're a little bit of a wide leg jean. I kind of prefer him in a skinny jean. He's really tiny. Um, but these will be like really good play jeans. They're not going to be, he's not going to have them for that much longer. They'll probably last the fall and then he'll need like a new set. <laughs> um, I also found this pair of dress pants. Let's see if I can get these in the frame. They are Oshkosh brand, and they're really nice quality, um, heavier sort of fabric. These are a 5T. They are too long on him, but again, he will definitely grow into these. I think these were only $3, 3 or $4, um, and I knew that eventually at some point he would grow into them, so I was like, you're coming home with me, even if they don't fit now. So this is a Baby Gap sweater. It's nice and soft, and again, there's like not really any pilling on it, um, just in really beautiful condition. Okay, so this is another sweater from Carter's. It is, uh, it's nice and soft. It has a little bear on it. We call Colt, Colty Bear, so <laughs> it's just kind of perfect, and it has this like little Sherpa, you know, neck thing. I think it's so cute. So this is a sweater that I think will be a Christmas sweater. Um, it's just like a nice pullover. Again, really soft, really nice. Um, I like the pattern, but it's definitely really Christmassy. I'm always looking for things like a head, especially seasonal items. Um, now, sometimes you can, if you go consigning or thrifting, you can find items for Christmas so that when Christmas rolls around and you're looking for like a new dress or a new outfit for your kiddo, that's when everybody else is looking too. So I like to get all of that stuff really early. Guys, we even have our Halloween costumes at this point and we've had them now for at least two weeks um, and this is like mid-September. So <laughs> I just don't, I just don't like that last minute rush at all. And then the last thing I found for him, which this was like my favorite score of the day because my little guy loves Batman and I found him this zip, well, let me just zip it so you can see it a little bit better. So anyways, this is a Batman hoodie and it's got the black sleeves, it's got bat ears and the best part, it has 
a mask. Isn't that so cool? He was so excited about this. He loves Batman, so it was just the hit. It was $6, but $6 for a hoodie um, isn't that bad to me. Every season, I do try and get my kids a new zip-up hoodie, even for the spring and summer. So I do try and have at least one zip-up hoodie for them that they can wear outside as the weather transitions and then again even indoors and stuff. So at least always one hoodie for them. So that was that's the bag. And um, that was everything for Colt. So let's move on to Aubrey. So I got these leggings and they are from Kirkland brand. These are actually too big for her. So she is uh, in between a seven and an eight right now. These are size eight, they're too big. But again, she will eventually grow into them. Aubrey doesn't like jeans and she does have some jeans left over from last year if she wants to wear them. Um, she's more into leggings, so that's kind of what I'm looking for. When you buy secondhand, depending on the age, sometimes leggings are really hard to come by because leggings are like a knit fabric. You can wear through them very quickly. Kids are, you know, hard on the knees and stuff like that. So it's tough to get leggings. Um, so that's probably just something that we'll have to purchase full price. But again, I always look and I did find these. So uh, there's no tag in these. I think these are all taking the tags off as well. Um, we removed them after she tried it all on. So then this shirt, I loved this shirt. It's so cute. Um, it's from the children's place as well. And I just, I don't know, those little jaggedy flowers, they're just adorable and I love this color. She looks super pretty in that color too. So then this shirt is from Oshkosh and this is a size eight as well. So let's go. And with a lot of the clothes, because again, I because I do consign, I try and go with a color theme. I'm not strict with it, but I do try and get things that are kind of in the same color family so that they can blend and match together. Um, so you'll see things with pink in them. Um, pink and obviously pink. Uh, just so that when I get the leggings or the bottoms, um, I can go with a few different colors or patterns that I know will match the majority of her items. So they're not just picking like a select pair of leggings that has a really fun pattern but yet only matches one shirt. So I just try and get everything in the same color. That isn't always possible but that's always kind of what's in the back of my mind. So then I found her this little denim shirt. It has little teeny tiny polka dots on it. It's so cute and she looks adorable in it. Um, next was this fun shirt again. Oh, this shirt was from Joe Fresh. This shirt is from Jimboree. And it has this little peplum on the bottom. And again, it has that pink in it so that it will go with a lot of you know, the plain colored leggings that I would probably pick up for her. I found her a pair of pajama pants for $2. I am always horrified at the price of pajamas for kids. We went to look at Joe Fresh, which is um, a brand here in Canada. I'm pretty sure that JCPenney sells it or used to, but it's a Canadian brand. Um, anyways, a set of pajamas, a top and bottoms for boys, like 5T, $22. Like, are you kidding me? $22 for clothing that you see for maybe half an hour and then they're sleeping in it the rest of the time you're in it. I just, it, it bugs me so much how expensive kids' pajamas are. Um, these pajama pants were $2 and they're like in perfect condition. They have the cutest little ice cream pattern on it, little tie here on the front, um, and they're from Gap Kids. They were two bucks, so I was really, really happy with that purchase. And she can just wear a million different little shirts with those. And speaking of pajamas, I also got her this pair. 
And even as I was checking out, the woman was like, you got some really great finds. She's like, these look like they've never even been worn. And it it's true. Like, I don't think these were ever actually worn. So it's a top. It has like cute little pink ribbing. Um, and then matching bottoms. Again, cute little ribbing. They're from Kirkland, which are actually my favorite brand of pajama pants. Kirkland, or pajamas. Kirkland pajamas are awesome. They wear so well. They're really quality material. And some of them are even made with organic cotton. I don't know if these are. No, these are just 100% cotton, but a lot of them are organic cotton. Anyways, this two-piece set was just a few dollars, and it was never worn. Ah, they're so, so cute. Okay, so then I picked her up actually a t-shirt for next year. So it's just this kind of plain, kind of matches me now, <laughs> plain um, cap sleeve t-shirt. And this is a switcher brand. I don't know what brand that is. But it was $2. Um, and funny thing was is that the day before I had just picked her up four t-shirts from Joe Fresh, brand new, for $2 each, um, and super cute colors. So already she has five t-shirts for next year, and we probably won't need to get her a whole, whole lot from that. Yay. <laughs> so I'm, I'm, of course, I'm looking for next year as well, just, you know, as things are clearancing out, looking for next year. Okay, so this is another Joe Fresh shirt joe fresh is like super popular here because it's like the grocery store brand but they're like super cute clothes um kind of just like a plain navy top but it's it's a looser cut it's got this little keyhole in the front it's cute so again like i've got a lot of pink i've got a lot of navy um and these pants Oh my gosh, I love these pants. I wish they would fit me. I would love to have these as pants. They're from H&M. They are pink <laughs> with these glitter polka dots. And they look so cute on her. Now these are like a jegging style, but they're just like an elastic waist. They just look like they're jeans, but they're not. Um, so soft and comfortable for her. And they will mix and match with so many pieces that she had. Um, I had her try these on and then try on a lot of her tops and a lot of the tops just went really great with those pants. So I don't know, that was just, that was fun. Um, and then I've got like one more item beyond this. But this was another shirt from Joe Fresh um, and it's a leopard print, cheetah print. Um, top it's got like a little bit of a shimmer to it and she always looks really good in these kind of colors so I thought that was cute and then I did get one more thing for Colt um, this was a brand new hat it was Cherokee brand and I got this set for $4.99 it came with mittens he loves it and it's so soft like this like Sherpa lining oh my gosh it is so soft and so lovely and it's brand new so I got it half off which is really awesome I also picked up a few stocking stuffers for my kids I am in Christmas shopping mode right now and they had a bunch of stuff at the register that was brand new um, for two dollars each it's talking quiet because um, so I thought I'd show you. So, this is for Aubrey. It's one of these things. So you stick it in the water and then it grows. Um, and then I got one for Colt. This is his. So again, two bucks. My husband's calling. I'll call him back. And I got Colt two of these. He loves dinosaurs. And they are 
phthalate free, which is really nice to have when you have a plastic item. And then, because he got those, I got Aubrey this pink one, and it's squishy. So, she's gonna love it. So anyways, that is my haul. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.